Hey guys! Today we'll be making a few miniatures of things that you can get at Sephora, so I hope you'll enjoy. I'm just going to go with the shopping bag really quickly because it's basically the same thing as in my Bath and Body Works tutorial, so you just want to sketch it out and color it. Then glaze it, cut it out, fold and glue it together. Then I added some wire for the handles, painted that using acrylic paint and added some tissue paper. For the naked palette I first rolled out some brownish clay and use the dotting tool to make the hole for the brush. I then trimmed all the sides except from the top one, cut and pre-baked a small piece of clay and used this to make the dents, then trimmed the rest. After baking, I used acrylic paint and mica powder to make the eyeshadows. Glue that onto a piece of paper and paint that as well as the palette itself using some brownish acrylic paint. I chose to write naked on the inside before cutting it out and for this I used some gold colored alcohol ink. Then trim it and add the mirror. For the mirror I used aluminum tape but you can also use some tin foil or some silver colored alcohol ink. You then want to glue that onto a new piece of paper and paint that using a darker shade of brown acrylic paint. Then write naked on the outside as well and fold it. For the brush, roll out a tiny snake of clay, flatten the ends and glue on some fibers. I used merino. If you have any questions about the fur and hair I use in my videos, please check out the basics video I made for that. I then trimmed the bristles, painted the brush using acrylic paint and added some brown pastel near the base of the bristles. To make the primer potion it's very similar to the lotion I made in the Bath and Body Works tutorial, so you just want to roll out a snake, cut off a piece, then round off the edges on one end and flatten the other end. Trim it and add a few details.
add the tip and bake. Now find a needle tool with a similar tip and use this for sculpting the lid. I used some greyish scrap clay but you can use whichever colour you want. And after baking I painted that using silver coloured alcohol ink and wrote SCS on the tube. The lip gloss is pretty much the same thing, although the tip is a tiny bit different. And I cut it at an angle after baking. To make the lid for this one, I wrapped a thin sheet of clay around a needle tool with the right thickness. Then after pre-baking, I added clay to one end and baked again. You can then add some details using acrylic paint. To make the case for the eyelashes, roll out a sheet of white clay and use a needle to make a dent. You will have to excuse the stains on my nail polish, I was playing around with some alcohol ink. Place this on top of a thin sheet of black clay. Cut and fold the sides, then bake. After baking, I made the lashes using tiny pieces of mohair. And to finish off, I just used some black acrylic paint for the band itself. Seal everything with glaze and you're done.